No cuts. Good jobs. No cuts. No closures. No cuts. No ifs, ands, or buts. No closures. No cuts. My name is Jamie Partridge. I'm an organizer with Communities and Postal Workers United. A fabulous national grassroots network of coalitions of communities and postal workers to save the postal service. Yeah. Postmaster General is on a tear to close half the mail processing plants in this country. He's already closed 30% since Whoa. July. Whoa. Uh, their own studies show that they're going to lose more in revenue than they'll gain in the cost cutting of eliminating jobs. It's bad. It's a bad, bad move all around. Representative Val Hoyle from Eugene. We're here to save a post office because let's remember we have vote by mail in Oregon, so every post office is a ballot box, and we are not going to let them take away our distribution center. It is not right that someone in Salem should send their ballot to Portland to come back here and be counted. My dad delivered mail for 42 years and he was a letter carrier. And he got back from Vietnam and went straight to work in the post office, stayed in Coos Bay on the same route for 35 and finally the last few delivered a different route. So I got to know the people who work inside the post office, the people who, the, the letter carriers, the postmasters, everybody in that building were part of our family. Yay! This is the People's Postal Service, but it seems pretty obvious that the Postmaster General doesn't remember that. And so we have to teach him today. Okay, everybody, just want to let you know that uh, the manager of the facility is resisting cooperation with our uh, First Amendment rights here and is claiming that by being in this area, we are, quote, subject to arrest. Uh, I disagree, and I'm not going to leave until the police tell me that we can't be here as part of the public because the post office is is ours. Save Salem's mail, we shall not be moved. It's like a tree, a standing pile of waters. We shall not be moved. You feel like folks who, like those folks who are in front of the office then, then trespassing or obstructing or what have you? Well, if they interfere with the day-to-day -day business operation of the post office and we would have to intervene there but at this point being out here and to where customers can still have access and okay all right okay thanks what's your what you need sergeant moore moore okay uh the officer told me that as we probably all expected since this is uh, we pay taxes to keep this business running uh, uh that as long as we're not interfering with business we are not trespassing uh, so we're okay here. Uh, the only reason that someone would uh, be in violation of that is if they, for instance, stood in front of the door and people had a hard time getting in and out. So uh, I'm not sure. Uh, oh, look at that. Okay, so if anybody has any other questions, let me know. That. There are 25 people out of here walked off the job as of 1 February. Fe February 1st. So now, OPM. Uh, hey, Office of Personal Management. Right. Office of Personal Management is so screwed up and backlogged that therefore no one ain't getting no money. Well, at least part I ain't. I've gotten two hundred dollars, one from last month and another two hundred the last first month. Jesus Christ! A retirement. Yeah, your pension, right? That's yeah. Now, what what that, were you expecting that retirement package to be? I'm sorry. What were you expecting that? 
retirement package to be? How much was it you were you expecting okay. to see per month? Let's take, take, take you guys for example. You retired. Guess what? Within 30 days, you should have your retirement check. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but you, we've got enough. I mean, that that's mine. I don't know if that's why I only came over here for. That's not that. That's, that's ridiculous. It's a long time not to receive any. Well, what, $200 is all you've received? I'm sorry. You received $200? Receipt. I've gotten $200, bucks, 100 bucks a month. I get more on my VA disability. Yeah, and they don't, they don't even I, do you I, well. I, I, I tried uh, what's called unemployment. You no. can't get unemployment. You're getting a retirement check. I'm two months behind on my house payment. Jesus Christ. And 20 years of public service, and that's what you get. Wow. Thanks, Thank you. Family wage job. Yes. Clint. Understand that people are making this sacrifice for the good of the broad community. They're not doing it to be rabble rousers. They're doing it because we think what's happening is against the interests of, of regular people and for the interests of big businesses and corporations. And Joe and a Bobby, boldly going where the corporate media won't.